How's everybody doing? It's the Hawking Regime here, and today I'm just coming at you guys with an update on the Seattle Seahawks. As you know, I am doing the uh, Talk of the Hawks series here on the Hawking Regime channel, but today, big news, uh, the big 31 Bam Bam Cam Chancellor is actually back for the Seattle Seahawks. Uh, he will be uh, in this, I don't know if he's going to be in the starting lineup, but he is back with the Seattle Seahawks, as you can see right here. Uh, you see him in practice today. Uh, he actually did return uh, from his holdout of I don't even know how long, but it was quite a lengthy holdout. As you you know, he missed the first two weeks of the NFL season, but he is back. Just super excited to have Cam Chancellor back on the Seattle Seahawks, man. Uh, definitely, I mean, I, I don't know if he's my favorite defensive player, but I, I it's hard to say because I actually, if you've been on my channel for like the since the beginning of when I started, I actually made a Cam Chancellor highlight video. I was so inspired like by his play, I guess. I love them so much the way that he approached the game and how his intimidation factor for the Seattle Seahawks defense was, uh, you know, like not comparable to some other uh, types of defenses I've seen. So uh, definitely cool just to see him back on the field. I mean, it's awesome, man. It's so, so, so awesome that he's a part of the Seattle Seahawks. Such a great player, a great safety. Uh, I never once really had hate for him during the holdout. I just kind of wish he would came, he would come back. I know there were some Seahawks fans out there that just, you know, just were frustrated at what he was doing. Uh, you know, there's definitely frustration there in the fact that he wasn't there. Uh, but it's just, it's so cool to have a guy like him back and the type of, you know, uh, intimidation and strength and uh, ability and intelligence that he brings to the secondary and to the defense in general. Uh, so definitely a more vital part to our defense than I think. A lot of people expected. I wouldn't say that the Seahawks would struggle for the rest of the season if he had held out for the rest of the year, but I uh, do think that he provides an, an incredible asset to the team, and uh, it's a great thing that he's in good health. You know, he's at a good age, and he's a great part of the squad or the great part of the Seattle Seahawks organization in general. I just hope that you know things aren't uh, too uh, you know too rough uh, rough around the edges between. Uh, the relationship of Cam Chancellor and the Seattle Seahawks and its organization. And uh, I don't know if it's too much to have to do with Pete Carroll, but just, you know, the money aspect. And I hope he doesn't, in the future, have any problems in terms of holdouts like this. You know, maybe we'll be able to clear some, uh, you know, money in the future. We, we, we'll see what happens. I just, I, Cam Chancellor is like one of my favorite players. I don't want to have to see him, uh, you know, have to go and do something like this again. It's just going to, it would be another really tragic uh loss for the Seahawks even if it was temporary like it was right now but you know as of right now it, it would be so sweet to see him going on Sunday against the Chicago Bears which will be the next talk with the Hawk episode when we see him uh, uh, going up against the Bears you know <clears throat> because uh, you know that's what that hopefully that can be our first win of the season you know back at Century Link Field at home would be sweet to see him there uh, you know, Cam Chancellor, just going to be great to see him in his debut for the Seattle Seahawks and the home opener for the Seattle Seahawks. will be intriguing to see how we play against the Chicago Bears, and they're pretty solid offense, although they have had some injuries. So, uh, you know, again, will be interesting as always. And, uh, yeah, that is actually going to be the conclusion of the video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. You know, make sure to subscribe to my channel for more Madden NFL 16 content, as, long, uh, as well as these Talk with the Hawks series episodes, you know. I'm not, I, this is like one of the first times I've ever done something like this where I actually, uh, you know, show you guys something that's not a, a pre-game or post-game analysis, but, you know, I just wanted to do this because this is probably one of the bigger news stories you're going to hear of the Seattle Seahawks aside from, you know, the actual games, uh, you know, that's a pretty big picture right there, Marshawn Lynch and Cam Chance, they're probably two of my favorite players of the Seattle Seahawks at this point. Uh, they've had just such incredible impacts on one on the offensive side of the ball, one on the defensive side of the ball. So, you know, awesome, awesome to see those guys back together. Once again, hopefully you guys enjoy the video. I'm going to see you guys on Sunday against the Bears. Hopefully, you know, we come out with the victory. I will be coming at you guys with the pregame analysis prior to the game beginning. So once again, for like the third time, hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. And yeah, thanks for watching.